joy, 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 walking this evening in paradise. And what you see are not necessarily only just fairies flying around, but dragonflies. It's the dragonfly mating day. And they are magical to me. They're all about transformation. Hello, Cody. Welcome to paradise. We're looking at the dragonfly mating day. There they go. There's a couple of them around. There's even a butterfly. Yep, here it comes. So it's a lovely, it's a warm, sunny, it's about six o'clock on the east coast of the USA of New York. There you go, there's a big one, flew right past the, the lens. So this is my daily walk, and every day there's something new and magical. And today it is dragonflies. Here we go, lots of them over here. Lots of them over here. It's a little muggy. We've had a lot of rain the last few days, but it's beautiful out. So we'll keep on walking for a bit. We'll see how long this keeps up. I see how long the battery is. But that was the dragonflies. Sometimes one year they were so intense it looked like a cloud in the middle of the road. I was driving and I said, what's this cloud? It's like hovering in the sky, just about the height of the car. That, well, windshield. And when I stopped, it was just hundreds and hundreds of, look at that view. Look at that view. Hundreds and hundreds of dragonflies. In here we see, even though it's August, we see all these apples are getting ready for the fall and winter. Mother Nature's preparing months ahead of time to make sure creatures and humans have fruit to eat. These apple trees are so old that the local cooperative extension doesn't even know the names of them. This used to be all apple orchard country. My property has so many apple trees and each tree has a different type of apple. It's really cool. Oh, it's nice in the shade. Nice breeze. Walking in paradise. Normally I go out in the morning, but I had a lot of editing to do on my TV show. Walking, no, <laughs> walking with our angels. Talking with our angels. Walking in paradise. Different shows. They rhyme. I only do things that rhyme. <laughs> only TV shows that rhyme with walking and talking. Down there is a, a goat. The back of a goat. Looks like a, a pregnant goat. And a rooster. Yeah. Hello, Mama. She's butting her head. Let's see if I can zoom in. Meh. I got her attention. That's cool. All right, I don't know how to get this wide again. So, do is I just flip it to me and then flip it back, and there we go. And we're headed back down our walking in paradise afternoon session, evening, early evening. And check out 
You see this, those who will walk around here with me in the mornings. I get to see the sun. That's like kind of like just after sunrise. This is closer to sunset. Sun's still pretty high. <clears throat> I think it sets about 8.30. So we've got some time. Just very peaceful. Go oh, back to my TV show. So I have about 10, let's see, six and seven, eight, nine, ten. I have 10 episodes edited and sent over to the network. Oh, here's a horse. Say hello, horse. He's very shy. Not sure. So there we go. Zoom in. Say hello, Mr. Horse. And I'll get the light. And I'll get the light. I don't know what's happening. I'm going to have to take a lesson in running this camera. Oh, it's coming out to say hello. Maybe? Yes? No? No. Nope. Okay. Lots of love, little horse. Look at that view. You can see all the spirits in the air. Paradise. I kid you not, walking in paradise. So we've got about 10 shows up, 11 shows. I'm working on show 11. That should be up tomorrow. And then the 12th, 13th show, that'll be the, the first season. And hopefully they say they're going to start the show very soon, probably. We're, we're talking maybe this coming week even. I'm not sure. I'll let everybody know. I'll put up the schedule on talkingwitharangels.com with links. So you can see the show, the link to download the TV to go app. It will be on the She TV network. And you can find that on TV to go. The other cool thing, if you've been looking at my Facebook page lately, is a new show I'm doing in the, in the interim, because the first show, the first year of interviews are done. The first year of episodes the whole first year is done with a few extras so I stopped recording for now and I'll reimagine year two in the process so many people are saying oh you need to interview this person and this person so I created a mini show called angel feathers so instead of angel wings which are the whole the whole show Feather is just a piece of the show. So they're short three to five minute stories that different people are sharing. And I believe I have three or four of them done and a couple more coming up that I know of. And it's just easy going when somebody says, oh, is a good person to be on your show? Or I'd love to be on your show. Or I say, hey, you, why don't you come on the show? <laughs> And then it's a quick, quick one. It's kind of fun. Let's see here. Nice breeze. You can go to the, see the pond now. For some reason, it's easier to see today. And the pond goes all the way up there. Mornings, we can sometimes hear the bullfrogs. Different time of day. It's always different. The smells, the breeze, the colors, the energy. Same walk, different experience every time. So I'm very excited that Talking With Our Angels will be airing live on TV very soon. And I'm getting all the shows, at least for the first season or two, ready. Eventually all of them will be ready for viewing 
for the TV. What else can I tell you what's new? Well, my house is all cleaned up and nice and neat. And it's a house is on the market to sell to some angel loving person who wants to live in paradise. Then I'll head out to California or if nobody's buying and I get some some work out there in California, I'll just close the place down for the winter and spring and come out here in the summer and go to California. This is a great place to be in the summer. I love being outdoors. This is one of the best summers I, on record for me here in the last 10 years. It may be the best summer, weather-wise. June and early July, first half of July, crystal crisp clear. We've had more rain, a little more heat in August, at the end of July coming into August. But the nights are still pleasantly cool, so I'm enjoying that. Ah, I can smell the evergreen. You just stop and say, where is that wonderful aroma coming from? So we have the woods on the right. We have divine light and straight ahead. <laughs> we have fields on the left. And not a soul in sight, except for the spirit angels. The angels of nature, the devas. Anybody see gnomes or fairies or nymphs, wood spirits? You kind of feel they're all around. Feel them energetically. A friend of mine says if you're gardening, if you're doing any work in the garden, you ask the gnomes to come in and help you. And then when you go out to the garden the next day, everything is so much easier because they've done all the prep work. So, one thing when I used to garden, I would weed according to the astrology signs. And there are certain symbols, certain signs that are the barren signs. And it's when the energy is in the roots are the weakest. So it's very easy to pull the weeds out. So I used to like doing that challenge was that more weed seeds would fly into the area next thing you knew I had just as many weeds as before I spent way too much time weeding <laughs> it's it's nice though I love working in the garden and maybe get back to that again but I always prefer flower gardens to fruit and vegetable gardens oh speaking of fruit this is the first year in maybe at least five years I planted a pear tree probably six or seven years ago a mini a dwarf pear tree this is the first year I see fruit on the tree I'm so excited they're just little ping pong ball sizes now furry ping pong balls I'll have to get you a take a picture of it and show everybody Well, we're just about coming out of range. So I'm going to say, have a blessed evening. Get outside, get out in nature, find a park. Or just walk down the street. Find your paradise, live in your paradise as best you can. And it will always, and look for opportunities for more of your paradise. Low network connection. There we go. So we're losing our connection. I'll just walk back up a little bit. Joy, joy, joy. Mm -hmm.